Uh, my friend has led The Last of Us. Uh, it, was, it was a pretty legit game. Oh, yeah. It's very hard. Ammo very scarce. I liked it. Oh, yeah. Well, uh, I thought it was pretty, like, my friend was like, yeah, I bought it. So if you guys, my friend and I drove out to his house and we were sitting there uh, watching him play it. <laughs> it was pretty cool. I liked it. Oh, it's good as shit. I don't have a PS3. My brother does. I'll talk to buy it, but... Yep. Yep. Oh, uh, I don't think so, no. Wait, if you bat- wait, I wonder if I can invite you. Possibly. I'll let you. Yeah, I'll let you. Yeah, I'll let you. I've done it before. Ah, uh, I'm in the- uh, I'll- I'll join as soon as I bomb the hell out of y'all real quick. Cause I'm in the- You're on the same team. You're on the I mean, same you're team. Oh, I am? Oh. Yeah, you are. And now I'm on your team. Now I'm yeah, on your team. Now you're on his team. Oh, we're all three of us in your squad then. Oh, shit. That's Got two planes that are not in the but, air for um, some reason. I like how Call of Duty, they were like, oh, yeah, man, this is going to be different this year. We have a new um, engine, and it looked at the same. It's one over three. I was like, this is. It's. They they have they have never made oh headshot bitch they have never like they haven't made an actual new engine like frostbite for instance in a very long time all they do is just put little patches on their current engine like yeah it's like the Modern Warfare two to Modern Warfare three or like COD four to Modern Warfare they just parachute out in the ocean on his headshot his ass fuck 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 ah shit I should have had that guy try to. Melee him. Yeah, though, uh, playing The Last of Us on normal mode as opposed to survival mode is completely fucking different, like, because there's a hell of a lot less ammo and, like, resources and. Well, <laughs> like, it was kind of, it's not like. I, I mean, it's a zombie game, but it's kind of like. It's not like survival, like, it's survival, but it's more like the story, not like surviving, because you can gather food. Fuck. Like, <laughs> you gather stuff to like help you fight and everything. Like, I mean, like the story, like the guy has to survive, but it's more like you fighting. I, I don't know how to word it, the, you know what I mean? Like, I mean, the whole game, your objective is to get Ellie to this Firefly yeah. base camp that supposedly... Yeah. Has a uh, their own like quarantine zone and whatnot. Like I watched. Have you ever watched Frankie on PC? Uh uh No. Like he is. He's an English um YouTuber, but he did a walkthrough and I watched all of his videos because I never got the like. I mean I don't know the game, so I thought I watched someone that. But at the end, like that um. You like what do you think happened? Like what was your interpretation in the end? Like, so, well, I watched different YouTubers talk about it, and they were, like, all different. Uh, I mean... He shot the lady. I mean, the ending... I mean, I don't want to really... I mean, the ending is... I mean, it's the ending. I don't really see really too much interpretation. I mean... I mean, like, do you, do you actually think they were, like... They stopped looking for a cure, or do you think he just wanted to take her? He, I mean... If you think about it... His daughter died at the outbreak, and he had grown basically, like, cold, unattached to anybody except for Tess. And even, like, Ellie, when he first got her, for, for a good while, he didn't even really, he was like, oh, you know, whatever. But then, like, once, especially once winter came around and, you know, she was provide, you know, she was caring for him or whatnot, he kind of realized, hey, you know, she's basically like my daughter and, you know, like if, and he didn't even know, like, there was never like, a, oh, this is 100% fact, this cure will work. It's like, maybe it'll work, maybe we can make a cure. And, I mean, they, and I mean, even if, in, even if they made a cure, their bi their biggest threat never was the infection. Like the infection kind of started it, but he mankind's greatest threat was mankind itself. Because I mean, more people. I mean, once the infection happened, then people just started going buck wild, and there were no laws. And 
So, I mean, who's to say that even if the cure were to work, that they'd be able to take back, you know, all that land they've lost and... Yeah, there's somebody inside that lighthouse. Yeah, he's dead. I mean... Joel did the thing that most anybody would have in his position. Excuse me. Did you get that guy? Yeah, I got him. I think they kind of left off to where they can make another one. They they actually did say that The Last of Us is the start of like is a start of a new franchise. So yeah, they are gonna make some other ones. Will it necessarily be with Joel and Ellie? They didn't say. They just said that The Last of Us is a new it's a new series. Well, I think they I think they might do it to where it's like different perspectives. Like maybe it'll be Joel's brother, and then oh, fuck. Oh, like yeah. That um. Yeah. And I, I would like to know if the infection, if, if it's like a 28 days later thing to where, you know, 28 days later and weeks later, it was just isolated in London except for the end of 20 weeks later went to France. But, and I, because I don't, I'm, I don't believe they ever actually said whether or not the infection was uh, global or whether it was just in America. No, because in the beginning they were talking about, um, Different states, and I think they mentioned um, different countries because they said China. Oh, they okay. And the the thing I like about it too is the fact that it's I don't know if you've ever seen the movie The Happening with Mark Wahlberg, but it's it's I didn't think it was that bad. I mean, it was it was all right, but it, it's a lot like that in the fact that you know it was no terrorist group that started or whatever. It was basically like the happening where the environment had had enough shit and so here's this fungus yeah i like how that you fucking go i do like how that fungus is like a real thing like in some jungle somewhere but it does it's not like like that it's just like it affects like ants and like insects and small animals yeah Apparently there's this new virus that came out, and it's in like Italy and like Saudi Arabia, where like they don't even have a cure for it. I don't know if you guys heard about that or not. There's always new viruses and stuff like that popping up, but eventually, eventually mankind finds a way to. Like, have y'all seen the, uh, the movie, um, what was it? I think it's, uh, oh, Contagion. That was a pretty good one. Yeah, it was a good movie. I don't know, but I like 28 Days and 28 Weeks. That was awesome. Yeah. Walking Dead. Fucking love that. Yeah. I, I'm... Um, go ahead. That was a great, crazy. That was like the first movie that involved zombies running. That was pretty terrifying. Yeah, when, when there weren't really zombies, they're more in the infected category, like the rage virus. But yeah, that's fuck that, dude. I'd much rather live in the Walking Dead universe than the fucking Twenty Eight Days Later. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, most definitely. Is that like remember how they were like whenever that guy got rescued from the hospital, or whatever, and um they were in that um. They came. They went to that house, like where he lived or whatever, and he lit that light, and like all those zombies just came through, like the glass or whatever. And I was like, holy shit! Yeah, mm -hmm. I have to say the absolute, the absolute shittiest death on there was when the uh, the dad was they like at that old uh, quarantine zone, and they're walking through, and the dad looks yeah. up at that dead guy, and that one little fucking drop of blood gets in his eye. That was the shittiest fucking death. Yeah, I was like, yeah, and the fact that. And the fact that, that, like, the infection is, like, fucking immediately, like, as soon as, as soon as you get, like, any kind of infected, you know, fluid in you, it's like, you know, you're, you're fucking infected immediately. It's not like, you know, a couple days later or weeks later or whatever, it's immediate. Yeah, but like The Walking Dead, man, I, I like I watched it from day one. I was like, I think I was like the first out of all my friends, like, um, to watch it. And then I, um, they all came over, like, 
over, um, over the winter, and we all watched all the episodes on demand, and they like got hooked on it, and they all watch it now. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't watch it until um, midway through season two. Actually, it's probably actually it was the end of season two. In between two and three, it was a uh, like a couple months before I went to uh, basic because uh, the Walking Dead, uh, arc, uh, the Telltale game, Walking Dead game, came out. Walking Dead is, yeah. Yeah, I see him. I didn't really... Season 3 of Walking Dead isn't a bad season. It's just not the... My favorite of the three so far. But I... Well, season 2 was all, like, story. And then season 3 was more just, like... Story onto that. Like, season 1 was just badass. That, was, that shit was... Oh, shit. Oh, oh! Uh, oh, it... God. How'd I miss y'all? Not uh... it. It damaged me. It didn't get like if it was like a foot closer. Oh, I died. Fuck. I, I do like the fact that more and more like shows and games like you know Walking Dead season three. Well, actually Walking Dead in general, and you know people give that a lot of shit. It's like oh you know they're not killing enough zombies and whatnot. I mean realistically, if there was a zombie apocalypse, mankind would still be its greatest threat. Like. Noob tubing son of a bitch, go fucking play well, it, Call it, of Duty. It's video, weird, like, you can see the transition where, like, it was all about zombies, and then, like, second season was kind of like people and zombies, Ugh. and then third season was pretty much all people. I, I wish, look, dude, Shane would have been so kick ass in season three. Fuck. I'm pissed that they killed Shane, but, I mean. Yeah. I was pissed off when they killed Dale. Yeah, and the cop, I, you know, I don't know if you've read the comics or not, but I read, like, like, uh, season four of the comics, and, like, they're, they're gonna switch Dale and Herschel, cause, in the comics, uh, Dale dies, not Dale, fucking Herschel dies, in, uh, instead of Dale, and Dale's the one that gets his leg cut off. And in season like season four, when they're uh, going up to Washington D.C., uh, Dale gets bitten, and he like runs off into the woods, and these like cannibals get a hold of him, and they start eat like they like they start eating him, and you know he's like starts laughing, they're like you know what are you laughing? He's like I've been bitten, and so I, I, that, that's what they're gonna do I guarantee it they're switching Herschel and Dale like that's that's what's gonna happen to Herschel I don't want to happen to Herschel because I like Herschel but I can see that happening I would like to know what they're gonna do with fuck me I got bombed yeah that dude like I was like playing at those dude like you were running into me with like suicide bombs I would like to see what they're gonna do with the governor I, dude, I was like, man, this guy's. I, I hated, like, I loved the season three finale, but I felt like it should have been two hours long because, you know, it picked it, it, it picked up so much, and it's, you know, the governor, you know, killing all those people and whatnot, and then all of a sudden it's just like, bam, ends. It's like, uh. <laughs> like a robot. Oh. Yeah, all of us, all of us down in tech school, we're just sitting in the day room, just watching, and all of a sudden, just, we're just like, no, it, it cannot end this fast. It's it's got to be a two-hour premiere, but Fire in the hole! yeah, I kind of wish they would have like, I don't know, Walking Dead, like it leads you on so much and then just like stops. Yeah, and it makes you come back. Yeah, that's ex exactly what they do. They get they they don't give you too much, but they give you just a, just enough to where you're like, damn, I I gotta keep watching. Yeah, but I like I watched them from day one, and I was like, damn, a zombie show. I was like, that's sweet. And then I started watching. I was like, man, this is sweet. Keep watching this, and I watched it even more and more and more. I still need to get um the new season of Spartacus, War of the Damned, <clears throat> and uh, the new Game of Thrones.